during October 30th at 11.59 at night, go outside. Draw an oval into the dirt with your hands. If you use any tools, it will not work. Place your phone on vibrate and set it in the middle of the shape. You must keep focus on the phone because if you look away, there's a good chance it might vanish. Did I not mention? Something wants to stop you. You can't see it. You can't touch it. It can see you, but not touch you. Try not to take much note of that. At 12.15, you should receive a call from a private number. Don't answer. No one knows what happens, but there's a good chance you will die. Again, take no note of that. After a while, you should receive a text from the same number. It's safe to read. It will disclose a number, which is safe to call. Call it and make sure to keep it on speaker. But remember, you can't break focus. If you call it, some man with a deep raspy voice will answer. It will be silent for a minute or two. Then he will ask you for your address. Tell him, it's okay, you need to. He will agree to send you a package two nights later at 11.59. They will, as soon as the clock strikes 11.59. They will appear without warning, except a knock on the door. If you open the door, you will find a package. It is sealed tight in a blank cardboard box. If you open it, you will find a small radio. Put in the batteries that come with it. They will last you a year. At 12.15, tune the radio to AM 11.1. The man will speak in a deep mumble, untranslatable. You will feel a slight headache. Don't stop listening. He will get louder and your headache will grow more painful as he progresses. Don't stop listening. At 12.25 exactly, he will stop. A joyful tune will play. Your headache is gone. As long as the radio plays somewhere you hold dearest, such as your house or car, you will gain endless amounts of good luck. It doesn't matter if you can hear it or not. You will win at every sport you play. You will pass every test you take. You will win every bet you make. You are undefeatable. But one day, you will hear a loud pop. Start running. The batteries died. The thing can now see and touch you. It will stop you now. And all you can do is keep running. It will get you eventually. In time.